Oh, hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I know you haven't seen me in a long time because during this COVID situation, um, I'm limited on space, so I'm not really able to film that much. But today, I can film in my bathroom as you can see. And I'm just gonna show you my nighttime skincare routine. Now I have some new products that was given to me by a friend and I've never used them before but we're going to try them together. First I have something called Pharmacy Clean B and it's an ultra gentle facial cleanser. This is a facial cleansing gel that washes away surface oil, impurities, pollution residue, and makeup while nourishing skin with honey and hyaluronic acid. Next, I'm going to exfoliate. I know some people replace cleansing with exfoliation, but from what I understand, you're supposed to cleanse your face first before you exfoliate. So this contains black truffle extract that comes from black winter truffle and it's an anti-aging, antioxidant powerhouse ingredient. And it also has apricot seed powder to gently exfoliate. It has sweet almond extract which is high in vitamins A and E. It also has squalene and that's extracted from Italian olive oil. It's a nourishing oil that mimics the skin's sebum aiding to regulate moisture and oil production in skin for a more hydrated and supple complexion. So I just wet my face and I'm gonna take this gentle face cleanser after I open it. I'm gonna use just about that much. And gently rub it on my face. Now, if you look back at the video up here, I did have an allergic reaction a little over a year ago and it did not completely go away yet. I'm a little afraid of using new products or certain products, but we're just going to see what this does. It feels really nice and smooth. Now when you're cleansing or moisturizing your neck, you always go in an upward motion. I know my face feels like it has aged, puffed up, and my skin is not in the best condition since I've been stuck in the house quarantining. I haven't been able to get the sun and exercise that I need. So I'm just going to massage that in real good, making sure I get my forehead and my smile lines by my mouth. So now I'm just going to thoroughly wash this off. Okay, so for the exfoliator, it says apply a liberal amount over face and neck. Gently massage with circular movements for one to two minutes, avoiding eye area. Remove with a damp, lukewarm face towel and pat dry and apply two to three times per week. See, on this side is where the allergic reaction was, and I'm still having some breakouts towards my chin over here and over here on the side of my face. So I hope this doesn't cause any type of allergic reaction. I really love to feel the little exfoliation beads scrubbing my face. It feels like it's doing a good job. Now I'm just going to rinse this off and I'm going to take my bath. Now I have a product that was also given to me to keep the wrinkles, etc. away from my eyes. I'm hoping that my lens is not too blurry because I just took a hot bath. But now I have a product that was also given to me that I'm going to use for my eyes. This is a perfect combination of retinol and ruby crystal complex. 
It illuminates the eye contour, helps smooth away lines, and helps reduce moisture loss. So using your ring finger, you apply to the bone area of the eye from the outside corner of the eye inward. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm just doing it. It seems like I feel a little heat around my eyes, like something is activating on there. Now I'm going to use my collagen night cream. This is a product that I've been using for a while. While I'm supposed to use it every night, I don't really use it every night, but I think I'm going to start. I'm going to use about this much and just rub it into my skin really good. At this time of year, you need extra moisture, especially if you've been in the house quarantining. I can see a nice illuminating glow. My face looks really clean and smooth and it has a glow. Thank you for joining in and I hope you like this video and please give this a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and thank you all for joining. Love you. Oh yeah, don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you can see any upcoming videos that I have created. Thank you so much. I love you all. Peace.